Welcome to another product presentation from TIS. This time it's the MFT Pro, a domestic and commercial multifunction tester. You'll see initially that there are no moving dials or parts on the unit itself. We've gone for colour touchscreen and push button because it's our experience that the moving parts and dials are the things that lead to expensive repairs further down the line. So the colour touchscreen is resistive, so we can use it with gloves on. And because it's colour, <clears throat> it means that we can make this tester really easy to use, although it's feature packed. So we can make it easy to use as soon as we turn on. If we want to carry out a continuity test, we press the green button. Even tells me which sockets to use on the top of the tester when I push the button, just to make things a little bit easier <clears throat> when you first get the, get the tester. So continuity uh, will read up to 1,999 ohms. So not only is it good for standard certification, it's good for fault finding on things like underfloor heating and such. Insulation carries out insulation testing at voltages from 50 volts right up to 1,000 and will read up to a gig ohm. Um, so it gives us really early indication when we're carrying out insulation testers to if anything is breaking down. Before we move on to the live test, one thing to say is the tester has got input detection protection on it. So if we are on a test which normally would require a dead circuit, but actually we connect onto a live supply and still push the button, the tester will lock me out or lock you out from carrying out a test if it's not happy with what it sees on the input. Regarding loop testing, it will allow us to do single and three phase loop testing and importantly, the no trip loop test on RCD protected circuits is highly accurate and highly repeatable. So even if we're in a factory where normally with other types of testers, we would get spurious readings. This will give us repeatable and accurate readings, single and three phase. We can also dial in the fuse and breaker characteristics of the circuit and the tester will then give us a thumbs up and thumbs down as to whether the reading is correct. Um, should they change in the future, um, if regulations change, then they can easily be changed at our end um, free of charge as part of maybe a calibration process. Obviously, we also have the capability to test RCDs um, and the RCD testing feature, we can do single shot or we can do a full automatic mode and we can do a full automatic mode, including ramp. So although ramp test is not necessarily a requirement, it's also a handy thing to know when we're looking at an RCD as to whether possibly it could be a little bit sensitive and then is going to be the cause of call outs further down the line. Obviously the unit will test all standard RCDs, but it also is set up to test the new six milliamp DC version for electrical vehicle charging installations, which obviously is going to be more and more prevalent as the months and years go by. In the next page, with an optional clamp, we can measure power quality. We can look at harmonics and we can look at power factor with this tester. We also have the facility to be able to measure earth leakage with the clamp that we can use for power quality. So if we've got earth leakage, RCD tripping faults, we can use this tester for that in conjunction with the clamp. We can also buy um, optional adapters to look at temperature, light and sound as well as a standard being able to measure percentage volt drop um, around, a, around a building or around a premises. And in the final screen, we have the facility to be able to test phase sequence so we can check if we're connecting motors that they're actually going to turn in the right direction. Incidentally, on every setting, when we go into the relevant test, we can press a help button. And if we've not got the instruction book to hand, it will draw us a nice little diagram on screen on how to carry out the various tests uh, that we're in. And the last little key there is auto mode. What we have done with this setting is we've combined all of the loop tests and all of the RCD tests in one key press on one visit to the board. So on this one, we will carry out live neutral, live earth, PSC, PFC, all of the six RCD tests, positive and negative half cycle, and the two ramp tests, all with one key press of the tester. And again, massive, massive time saver as well as being really convenient. 
The clip keys along the bottom, when we're carrying out this testing, we can store the results to the tester and then we can transfer the information to an Excel spreadsheet if we want to, co to collect all the information electronically. <clears throat> the unit comes with a harness, so it's really safe and convenient and easy to use when we're up ladders or working at height. Nice protective hard carry case that's got plenty of room in there for all the accessories and more certificate pads or whatever else. Three phase lead set, which also can be used for continuity and insulation testing with crop clips and probes. Mains lead and also what we also provide is our PR400 which is a probe with a button on it. So if we're in a position where we can't take our hands off the probe to touch the test button on the tester, that button there will um, command the instrument to test continuity insulation and loop actually from the probe itself. The unit comes with a three year guarantee. Um, a one year calibration certificate is in the box so you can get up and running straight away. Um, the TIS MFT Pro. Thank you for watching. We're also delighted to announce uh, breaking news, um, a new software upgrade on the TIS MFT Pro. You'll see now on the third page, we now have the EVSE icon on the MFT Pro, and that's a free of charge upgrade through Test Instrument Solutions. You'll see when you click in there, it also has got an interconnecting lead, which connects with our TIS EV Test 100 which allows you to do a full auto sequence test on an EVSE charging station. Please see our TIS MFT Pro EV video for a full demo. Thank you.